Hello everyone, welcome to this reading. This is a financial money, your money reading for Aries, all Aries for November 2022. I hope you'll enjoy it and let us begin. My dear viewers who are watching this view, this uh, video, uh, if you're not aware that uh, my left hand isn't working well, it's out of commission due to dead tendons, damaged tendons, and uh, Sam is doing uh, the cut shuffling for us and I'm very grateful for him. Okay, let us begin. Two major impacts that will impact your money. Aries for November 2022 and let's see what those two major impacts are first and foremost there might be some of you might be going through some sort of a loss uh, feeling emotionally unhappy where you are wondering about what the best thing is to do it still shows that even though there is loss but you still have got something to comfort you something that's there that's going to be comforting nevertheless I will clarify this card further and see the amount of loss and why it's happening the great news that comes next is this card here. This is the Wheel of Fortune, which is all about your destiny changing. And it also means that extreme luck and fortune will be pouring into your life and in all areas of your life will prosper and thrive and abundance is going to take over. So whatever loss is here, this card will compensate. So, um, yes. Let's have a look at um, the Sacred Forest. We'll take two cards and see what are the most important factors for November 2022 for all Aries. The first card is strength. So the ancient oak spirit is all about giving you the strength, the light, the energy, the power to overcome everything, especially in partnerships, all kind of partnerships, especially in your um, work, if you're working with someone, um, you are, if you are in the process of moving to a better job or uh, having your own business or standing on your own and doing your own thing, it is giving you the power, the strength to overcome all obstacles and to be prosperous and it's bringing the light into your life. The foundation of everything is going to be perfect uh, also with that strength card. Now we come to the second card, which is all about uh, uncertainty now a lot of transformations will take place um, and that might make you feel a little bit uncertain where you stand especially due to the um, five of cups but that's going to change because I feel like you are going to be given the freedom to move freely there's success coming your way and uncertainty will be removed by the power of the strength and by the power of the wheel of fortune uh, and a lot of transformations will take place so don't be worried when transformations are, are taking place they are taking place to remove the uncertainty now let's have a look at the um the next deck of cards which is the radiant tarot let's see what it wants to tell us more information for all areas get their money or financial reading Aries for November 2022 and we have your plans your wishes your achievements all being established this is a card absolute heaven this is about abundance and, hap and happiness and action being taken for you to establish everything you wanted so a lot of your plans and achievements and um, um, a lot of progress and actual uh, plans being put into action a lot of rewards coming from this card uh, a great victories and achieving exactly what you want is destined and especially with the card of the wheel of fortune that shows that abundance of fortune luck extreme is coming into your life and bringing you that dream life that you've always wanted this is when i say play the lotto play the lottery for those of you that might pay off your house uh, your homes pay off your mortgages buy new homes having the prosperity to do whatever you want play the lotto play the lottery play them small amounts five ten dollars a month even if you do a month and you do it continuously without stopping and your lucky lot of numbers are chosen for you and they are in the community section and the aries so that is magnificent, truly, those two cards. And then we have here the Hermit. The Hermit shows many of you are researching and going deep inside, diving deep inside and trying to see where the truth is and, and some answers as to why certain things happen. And this could be in connection to the Five of Cups. So it shows that you're looking for the truth, you're looking for the light. But the beautiful thing is with the Strength card, with the Strength card, it shows that um, you are going to be doing well and you are going to find the truth. The truth is going to release you and help you to uplift you to the next level. And the next level is spectacular. Let's see what else they want to tell you. 
and we have the ace of cups the greatest gift of all this is an amazing card and with the wheel of fortune it just shows that so much is going to be pouring so much abundance so many blessings are going to be pouring into your life where you will feel so lucky and so happy that's why the uh, destiny card the wheel of fortune is about extreme luck and fortune and the ace of cups is the greatest gift a lot of areas of your life will be prospering and thriving and it's going to be uplifting you and giving you everything you want so that is magnificent truly we have the death card something's going to come to an end the death card is about transformations that will take place in your life that are putting something to an end perhaps this is happening at a time where you are um, going introspecting and looking um, as to you know where you went wrong or what's happened uh, in regard to your work or business but i feel like this matter was destined with the death card shows that this matter is destined to come to an end it was time for it to end why because of a new beginning the death card always prepares you for a new beginning and that's why you've got the next uh, you've got the Ace of Cups being a new beginning that brings you uh, prosperity. And then you've got the Wheel of Fortune, a new cycle that brings you a lot of happiness. And happiness is there in every way with the Four of Wands. Okay, let's see what else. Now, um, we will clarify. Let's clarify and see what the loss is all about for the majority of Aries. What is that loss? Okay, it shows that this loss is to do with something that you have sort of maybe you had you, no control over or perhaps uh, you, you were making some de decisions that might have been wrong. You were tempted to make some decisions that were wrong. You need to, to really pay attention. When these two cards unite, shows that maybe you were not being generous in some way, not doing something or trying to avoid something, uh, trying to uh, avoid a payment or something that you might have incurred some uh, losses it shows that there was a controlling situation and something that was being excessive or was left undone perhaps for too long or something that you might have been doing for too long and it was wrong this is coming to an end but in the process of it coming to an end there were losses you did incur losses and it shows that also that there might be some entrapment um you know feeling that you're not free as much as you want things have become a bit harder for you perhaps you know you might have forgotten to pay a bill that might have uh, reached to a level of heights and that and then you were probably caught doing something wrong perhaps and you had to pay a big amount of money that's the loss here that incurred and also the loss could be that you might be having problems with your car you might have neglected your brakes and never fixed them for a long time not never fixed them sorry but you didn't fix it this is just hypothetically an example you might have left your brakes un uh, uh, you know not maintained well and then perhaps something was wrong with that and then perhaps you are now your cars in um, in the in the garage to get repaired and and you you know you might have caused an accident something like that could have happened this is just an example and you feel sort of now um, entrapped and not able to move freely and at the mercy of the circumstances so something excessive did take place but you will heal from this you will learn from this it shows to me because of the wheel of fortune is in this reading with these three cards here four card, five cards it shows that there was a lesson that needed for you to learn from to learn from the past learn, this is going to be your past learn from it so that you can avoid something bigger in the future this is why this happened so um you will surpass this and you've got the extreme luck to help you move forward now let us um have a look at uh let's see what the wheel of fortune will bring you the wheel of fortune is bringing you abundance first and foremost it's bringing you uh, unexpected money coming your way with the four of pentacles money to the highest level is coming to you out of nowhere unexpected this money is coming and it's going to help you big time it's also going to help you you are very protective of course with the four of pentacles you're very protective you want to lay proper foundations and plan for the future what you want to do and also with the two of wands it shows you could be relocating to a better life relocating to a better job relocating to a better business you know wanting to work for your own self perhaps but you are relocating and living a beautiful life the two of wands gives you expansion rewards that are coming action you will take to move forward to the next level and the four of pentacles is absolute abundance now both of these cards the four of pentacles and the wheel of fortune together shows that 
there is big large sums of money coming to you both of these cards show unexpected money coming incredible extreme luck and abundance of money pouring into your life prepare for that so you have an amazing new beginning that's going to give you all that and that is going to contribute uh towards the four of wands your wishes and dreams being established the four of wands being the greatest card in your reading showing that you'll be able to establish all your wishes and dreams due to all this money that's coming you'll have all your dreams established and of course with the ace of cups it just seals the deal all together and shows that you'll be thriving and emotionally you'll be very fulfilled right now what we're going to do is have a look at also i want to know about the strength uh, that the universe is going to give you. How is that going to impact your life? Teamwork. Someone wonderful is coming into your life. Someone like a soulmate that you'll be working in partnership with. Someone that's going to stand by you, support you. And there's the strength card again. This person, because of this person, you will unite and heal together. Because of this person, you will be very strong together. You're becoming so strong and you're doing so much together. There's a great business partnership that might be forming between you and someone. There could be someone that's going to be a partner like a lover that might be, you know, uh, someone that you could unite together and form a business together or form some sort of alliance. But it's great alliance, amazing um, bonds are being created here that is going to support you and move you forward. That is going to give you the power, the strength. That's the first thing that's stemming from the strength. And the second thing, the strength is going to give you the rewards you deserve. The six of wands is about recognition. You could be becoming very famous. You could be recognized for all that you have done and be rewarded for it. There's a great victory with the Six of Wands, a victory unlike any victory because it starts and it doesn't stop. It stems up to, to, um, to heights that you have not even expected and even imagined. With these, um, with this victory, it's not one victory. It's a few victories, a lot of abundance along along the path of your life starts getting established with the ones there establishment of a lot of your wishes your dreams slowly you're moving towards that and the universe you've got all their support behind you to get to all this recognition and rewards that you deserve so that is the strength that's what's giving you it's giving you all that abundance of knowing and then finally we'll do the uncertainty to see when will this uncertainty come to an end Let's have a look. Two cards that will explain to us the uncertainty and when it ends. One thing about this uncertainty, it is about freedom. I see that. Okay, wow, look at that. That is magnificent. This shows that this uncertainty that is being keeping you unhappy, your dreams and wishes are going to be established and that's going to give you absolute happiness. Happiness to the highest level. Ten of Cups, the highest level of happiness contentment having all your wishes and dreams established and giving you that sense of emotional fulfillment don't forget about the ace of cups that was about emotional fulfillment in your all the areas and these two cards are the highest level of happiness that you can imagine so the uncertainty will be removed and you are going to be gaining your wishes and dreams being established not needing anything and having the greatest happiness of all contentment to the highest level wow that is incredible We'll ask just one more question and we'll end this reading. Let's see what's been in your mind, what you're pondering about and what does the universe want you to know. One answer to all Aries for November 2022. One card only and let's have a look. And it says within the next few months, that means everything will be sorted out and your answer is going to be answered and this um, hardship that you're going through will be dissolved and um, uh, totally disappeared within the next few months. It'll be all great. So that is magnificent. I hope you enjoyed this reading, my dear viewers. I wish you abundance and abundance of blessings. Namaste.